What's going on guys, Victor here from Dextra Outdoors. Now, I'm gonna show you guys how to fillet this blackfish, also known as a toe tog. We're gonna be using this six inch curved fillet knife right here. So let's begin. And one thing I gotta say is these fish are extremely slimy. So I have a towel here to kind of help me, but you guys see that it even slides on the towel. So I highly recommend putting a towel or something down to help, help you guys with that. So first thing we're gonna do, tip of our knife, we're just gonna outline this fish, starting from the head, going down, all the way to the backbone. And we're not really going in there too much, just outlining our fish, and we're gonna go all the way down to the tail. We're also gonna go right here from the head, get into the head meat, we're gonna go around, and these blackfish have a pretty big uh, rib cage. So there's not much meat in the belly right here. So we're going to go down a little bit towards his anal fin right there because there's not much stuff over there to get. Now what we're going to do is we're going to use our left hand to lift up our fillet and our right hand to just separate the flesh from the bone. And it's not a race. Just take your time. And the main thing is you want to constantly feel your knife making contact with bone and you'll feel it and you'll hear it rather than just aimlessly cutting through and um, leaving a lot of fillet on your fish. You guys see that, you'll really start to see the bone rather than just the fillet. And you can hear it. When you're doing a good job, you can hear your knife running alongside the bone. And it's the same thing with every fish. So I just continue to make those strides down. And then when you get to around the backbone, what we're gonna do is we gotta separate this head meat, be able to lift it up. And then we're gonna lift it up with our left hand and you gotta break through these pin bones. And now what you're gonna see is there's gonna be a rib cage right here. We wanna go over that rib cage. So take your time when you're first learning, you do not want to go through it. You want to go over that rib cage. This is what the rib cage I'm talking about. Now, when you're over the rib cage, you can continue down the length of your fish. All the way to the tail. Okay. The rib cage, just like I told you, I'm just gonna continue to unfold, 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 and then when you're all the way down, now you guys see the entire fillet is exposed. The only place it's attached is down here. And listen to this. You guys hear that? That's what you want it to sound like. There's no meat left on this fillet. We went over the ribs rather than through them because you would end up cutting that off anyway. And now we're just going to finalize by going down here. Beautiful. There is your blackfish toe tog fillet. There's the proof in the pudding. The Dexter six inch getting it done. No meat left on there. Now you guys are ready to enjoy this. I'm going to show you how to skin it. I'm going to set our fillet over right here. You can use the same knife that I was using, but for skinning fish, I like to have a designated knife. I like to use either a seven inch or an eight inch narrow fillet knife because it's a little bit longer and it allows me to really get a better, just a better sweep. So we're gonna go ahead. You always, when you skin fish, you start at the tail section, work towards the head. We're gonna just get underneath here. We're gonna just start to separate Okay, I'm going to hold firmly with my left hand the tail section, the scale part, and we're going to work. And we're going to have our fillet knife slightly at an angle as we work up. And you guys see that this fish is very slimy. OK, 
Okay, there is the skin of our blackfish. Now I just, I missed a little bit, but that's very easily solved. You can just take your knife, get right underneath there. Okay, so now you have your perfect filet. And blackfish, they're not very bloody. They don't have a big bloodline, if any, and I think that's why people like them so much. So now all we have left to do is, you have these pin bones right over here that we're gonna have to remove. You can hear them. You guys hear that? So we're going to go ahead and we're going to go on both sides of those pin bones. On one side, now the other side. Be able to lift this up. And you're going to take your knife, you're going to go like that. Pin bones are out. Now if you missed anything, you go ahead and just feel around here. I don't feel any bones. So this guy is perfectly ready for the dinner table. I want to thank you guys for watching this video and if you're interested in the Dexter knives we use today, go ahead and check them out in the description box below or you guys can find them at DexterOutdoors.com. That's all the time I got for you guys today. Until that next filet video.